I'm near the dam. Meet me, and then we'll go to the observatory. That's the place you're looking for. But the observatory's soaked in chemicals. Find me in the two-story building squeezed between the dam and the promenade.
it's you. I remember you from the bazaar. Had a feeling we'd cross paths sooner or later. You patched up Barney, right? He whimpered like a baby as soon as he saw the needle. And those renegades, why are they after you? Probably the same reason as you. To access the GRE database. What do you want from it, Aiden? Why are you risking so much? I'm looking for my sister. Your sister was in the GRE? She... No, she was a prisoner. I haven't seen her in 15 years. A prisoner? You mean a test subject? I don't know what I'll find. She's... She's the only family I've got. The only answer to what Waltz has done to us. Waltz? He held us there. Had a hobby of experimenting on kids. Did you know about that? I was only a mid-level doctor, Aiden. I'm sorry. Want to know anything else? Or can we go? How are you planning to get us inside the observatory? Look, there's a security tunnel into the complex. It was locked up years ago. Give me the key, Aiden. Are you sure the key is functional? Well, it has been. Maybe the problem is that the building has no electricity. Is there any other way to get in there? It depends how much we're prepared to risk. A lot, if you ask me. Okay. Then come with me. I have something to show you. See those domes? Sure, but the place is flooded with chemicals. The GRE had a solution for that. When they created the THV Gen Mod, they had to protect their employees from exposure. But the THV what? The chemicals. They came up with blockers. Shots that would shield their workers for a few minutes from the fumes. Fortunately, I still have two doses. Had a feeling they'd come in handy one day. Oh, those must be worth a pretty penny. They are extremely rare. For now, we will need only one for you. So let's do this. When you get there, first restore the power. Then I'll be able to join you. Hold out your arm. Remember, the shot shields you from the chemicals for a limited time only. Can't I take the other one too? No, not at the same time. This stuff's too strong. Go as fast as you can to the smaller dome and from there to the higher one. You should find a door leading inside. There, you'll be safe. Then head to the B block. There you should find the building's main circuit breaker. As soon as you turn on the electricity, the security door will unlock, and I can join you by going through the tunnel I showed you. Now go, the blocker is working. <sighs> I wasn't the blocker is working. Limited time. That blocker won't protect you forever. Just go and turn on the power. <coughs> 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 Huh. 
locker is working. is working. Veronica, I made it through the chemicals to the first dome. Great. Now just get to the second one. Find a door, a hatch, or whatever leads underground. Right. Veronica, found the entrance. So far, so good. But how do you know this place so well, by the way? I was here just once, long ago. But I have a good memory. That sounds useful. Well, sometimes it's a curse. Really. Veronica, I have a horde of infected here. Shit. I hoped it would be empty by now. Well, it isn't. I don't know if I can get through. Use the UV flashlight on your belt. That should keep them at bay. Just don't stop, Aiden.
Hey, Veronica, I made it. The electricity's on. Great. The security tunnel is open. I'll try to take the elevator down to you. This place was quite the hive. Plenty of infected. But I got rid of them. They were people too, Aiden. They deserve respect. Aiden? What? What's going on? The elevator! It stopped! I see. I think it blew a fuse. I'm checking. Do something. Quick! Please! Don't worry. I'll fix it. Please, don't leave me here. Don't be afraid. I just need a moment. Sitting on my hands here, Veronica. Try to breathe. Slowly. Uh, oh. Don't leave me. Just don't leave me here. Shouting won't do anything except attract infected. Yeah, calm down. I won't leave you. Veronica, the power's back. You all right? Veronica, I'll meet you by the elevators. everything would work out. Just get in. always been claustrophobic? Seriously? For over ten years. So what happened then? Aiden, for God's sake! Can we not talk about this right now? The, the database. Where is it? Just give me a moment. Below us. Even farther than this? Another six floors down. This is pretty high tech. Before the GRE, this complex was run by the military. They used it to monitor threats, rocket attacks, that sort of thing. That's why they called it the observatory. Then the virus came and that was the end. That's quite the story. They used to call places like this witnesses to history. Dark again. Wait, I'll try and figure something out. If we have electricity here, we could use it to power up the whole floor.
That's the only way to get to the database, Aiden. <sighs> Now, I'll just plug this cable in. It might work.
I need to get in there somehow and get that door open. <sighs> Smart move. Rerouting the circuit. Yeah. Saved my life a few times. Veronica, should we get going? Yes. Let's get this over with and then get out of here. This way. The main computer is there. You'll finally know what happened to your sister. She's all I have. What about your parents? I don't remember them. Just her. We... <laughs> we were a good team. Without her, it's like, uh, God, I don't know. You don't know what? Well, I don't really know who I am. We're all different people than we were 15 years ago. We all got lost. It's here. <laughs> 